The important thing about this club is that we exist. It's testament to what people power can still achieve. First finding out about the project, a group of fans who decided, OK, we're going to make our own team and these are going to be our own rules. And they went out and did it. I thought it was uh, quite a, a remarkable story. The next stage with, like, with any job is uh, have to get my crew and my team together to work on it. A bit like a football team. The longer you play together, the longer you work together, the better you know each other. I wanted to find out the, the characters in life that are really kind of rich or quirky in, in their kind of knowledge or outlook on the world. When we got there, it was trying to find some of these characters and the first one we came across was Graham, who was a groundsman. And he was just, a, as you say, salt of the earth chap. He was perfect in terms of being very, very articulate, but in a way of using language that is really accessible. He's just um, a very warm character. Finding out how to run a football club is something none of us had any experience of. We're fortunate in having quite a wide fan base with people with very many different varied life skills. We just find the right people to fill the roles as they come up and somehow it, it all ticks along nicely. Well, I've been a member since the start, since the uh, inaugural season. The, the logic behind it appealed to me, so I just got involved, uh, got in contact, donated my £10, and uh, here I am. <laughs> just when, when you finish volunteering, you go on the terrace and join everyone else after the game, join the players in the bar, um, which is a bit ridiculous, to be honest. Standing next to some players that you've been cheering on for 90 minutes, like, you, there's other clubs you, that never happen. We're not bothered whether we win or lose, we're always 100% behind the team. Just wanted to go back to the basics of grassroots football kickoffs at 3 o'clock on a Saturday, half past 7 on a Tuesday or a Wednesday, that type of thing. Alec and his dad, it was nice to see their little interactions, especially seeing how embarrassed Alec was when his dad started chanting. It's always nice to remember what, what it felt like for your parents to embarrass you. We're FC, we're United, we will never be divided. Can we have one with both of you together? <laughs> oh, I was thinking it. Everyone's seen that I have these plans. Trust me. When it comes down to kickoff time, it's gonna be we're gonna get one over on Benfica. It's gonna be it's gonna be amazing to see Broadus Park full playing Benfica. If you believe you can achieve things, people power has still got a role to play. We said we'd do it and we've built our own ground, we've made our own club and the only way we're going is up and we'll just carry on going up and up and up till, till we reach the top. Save me, save me.